Hello and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Bingo. It's time for the last of the challenge seeds for this week's Minecraft Bingo Seed Challenges. This is the practice seed, uh, which is 293233. Is that right, actually? Let me check. I thought, no, yeah, that's right. Um, the spawn point. I don't remember. Um, I think there was another village, but it wasn't Visver. Just, I don't remember. There might be a village. It doesn't matter. We're gonna break out this card, and we'll play it Brian as we always do. We need uh, 10, 10, 10, 35 iron, I believe. Um, two gourd, one diamond, one lapis, but no emerald, and then four redstone. So not horrible. Um, pretty okay actually. Uh, we need two ink sacks and then some bone meal we need the uh, acacia sapling the beet roots which if there's a village that could obviously work uh, out very well with that also the mushrooms so keep the boars we need one cactus green we need one gunpowder and some paper one two three is that it i think so uh slime board wine um melon and a cookie the cookies if we, if we see a trade for it maybe we try and go for that i'm not sure if that's worth it maybe though um we need the string we need a saddle we need to cook the stone for the repeater the gas and the clay we need to milk a cow two chests and then some wheat for the cookie if we don't end up trading for it and the mushrooms uh, not a horrible card it depends i guess if the village gives us the beet roots maybe the cookie maybe a diamond maybe a saddle I don't know. All right, there is a village. I don't see a blacksmith. Uh, also, I don't see very many farms. But I guess that's going to be okay. I don't see a chunga right away. Oh, there's another village. There are two villages. Okay. That should really up our chances of getting at least one of the rare items, either the diamond or the saddle. I feel like two villages without blacksmiths would be kind of unlucky. I mean, it's not unheard of, but I feel like the second one should have one. And then we should, I, I mean, I don't want to chinks anything, but we should definitely get the beetroots from two villages. I would be very annoyed if we didn't. And obviously that's already a really, really big help because the beetroots otherwise can be a nightmare and rule number one of being fast when breaking out cards in minecraft bingo is avoid nightmare scenarios <laughs> so here we go let's try and do that sand clay you need to find a nice swamp there is like i mean that is a swamp but that that's never gonna spawn <laughs> slime actually it might because it has a pretty nice spot in the middle of the ocean here if you like out there it might be the only land loaded and then you actually might be able to get one here uh, and then yeah this is also swamp obviously so it's not horrible i would like some clay right here and i would like to just hop around this mountain and i think i want to loop whatever this way is first and then right and then back the way we came kind of thing not sure if that's the best strategy but that's my strategy for now i need three paper this is probably not worth it we definitely don't need any more paper because there's no emerald there's no trade this because we need the shear item and the milk bucket so five iron would be a very good start right here i don't think i want to smelt right away i think i want to go to the village first see what's what and then hope for the best we need flint we don't no ah, that's good enough i think Actually, yeah, give me one more while we're here. I don't know where the village is exactly. 
and this could be an interesting cave system, mostly in terms of, it's right here, mostly in terms of dungeons, actually. There's a red mushroom, which I think I want to grab before we do anything else, because then we can throw out the bows that we haven't made yet. It's not a swamp here. This is not a bad area, all things considered. No beetroots here. There's a blacksmith. I mean, that's good. Uh, let's, yeah, let's just do these things right now, and then just take this. That's fine. And then also cook these. Obviously, should have done that immediately. Are you a farmer? No, you're a blacksmith guy. Do you have no beetroots here? That is kind of annoying. wheat and stuff lots of carrots that's not great that's really not great I'm not sure also the trade is not super worth it even if you get it here. because there's no no emerald and no no cake yeah spin do it guy great dancer Give me the torches and then I think we'll just go. Or, yeah, we'll just go. And, yeah, we'll check out the other village right now. She's gone around, but whatever. Uh, she is right now for the vine. I don't care about blocks right now. We have the mushrooms. This is a nice looking swamp. I very much enjoy this place. And then, yeah, that's the other swamp down there. There's a lot of iron here, too. This is not a bad spot to be at night. We still need a cactus green and an acacia sapling. This should be very doable right here. It's not the best tree to chop. And actually, let's uh, cook this. And there it is. I couldn't find my book. There it is, though. This. Ah, well, whatever. I guess we'll just do this and that, and this and that. Actually, I have to wait. That and that. Doing okay, not great, but okay. I think it was one cactus green. Don't need a book. Lots of wheat. There it is. Okay. I don't think we'll have six here. Oh, we do. Amazing. And we actually picked up six too. Uh, yeah, I don't think the trade is even worth it. Because we're not really doing anything else. And I don't think we can even make a trade. Because there's no... No, don't throw that. There's no farmer here. It's our... Butchers and that kind of stuff. Just really not what we need. All right, fair enough. <laughs> we didn't get everything, but I mean, it's fine. Are you actually a farmer? No, you're not. Right. No. Also has a white apron thing. These guys are not good. No, okay. So slow. I feel like I'm playing incredibly slow. Maybe because I am. Uh, throw away these seeds and make this thing and make that thing and make the bucket for the milk and I guess make the hopper so we can get rid of this chest right away. 
And yeah, we can probably... No, not that. Ugh, come on, game. Not game. Come on, Clover. It's not the game's fault. Well... That's a lot of creepers. No gunpowder from two creepers, I think. If I, if I saw that right. Nope. Yeah, of course not. Gunpowder is like a super rare drop, apparently. This is kind of risky because I don't have good food, because I'm dumb. This was a very bad skeleton. Okay. I don't know. This doesn't feel very good. I hear another creeper coming. And we got some gunpowder out of that. Amazing. Still don't have a saddle. Well, we haven't found any places that could have given us a saddle, so I guess that makes sense. I don't know, we should check our iron count actually, because we are about 3, 6, 8, 22, made that 17, and we have, I don't see it, 14? So we're almost done maybe? Find cows, need to find chonger, need to get the sapling here before we leave. There it is. Need to make this and then that. And then now we can throw away some stuff. Uh, like all of this and that. And I guess this can be bone meal and we need the uh, ink sack still. All right, very good. Give me that. Give me that. Uh, put that there. Fine. Eat this for a little bit more saturation, and then I guess we do this. Uh, yeah. Okay. We're not. I mean, I don't love the pace, but it's not bad. Definitely not bad. The red mushroom here. I guess, yeah, we should be cooking this stuff up so we have it going. I think like one iron short or something crazy like that, which is pretty good. Especially since there should be more stuff here. And there is. We definitely want another bucket and maybe it's the second pick or something, so we'll grab seven or like just grab eight while we're here we need to fish so we want to kill a spider we need to get the ink sack still but our main concern right now is obviously the slime bar we're not in the like we're not in the bad spot for that at all we should be okay here i hope at the very least all right we need more food too <laughs> I need to milk the cow. We also need the string though. So this guy needs to die. One string. Not great. All these caves look like they could be very good for dungeons and we do need the saddle. We're kind of a little bit like too much in the swamp, maybe. It just feels like the game isn't really spawning any mobs, though. There's a zombie out there. I mean, all of this is still swampland. There could have been slime out here. Spawned lots of zombies out this way. For whatever reason. Nobody needs that. Uh, that spider's too far away for me to care about it. This spider, on the other hand, is in a good spot. That's our string. Down to spiders. We just need to kill this big slime without dying to the skeleton. Just don't. There we go. Ow. Um. I mean, that's one key thing. Done for sure. 
I think I picked all of that up. I don't think we've made a boat yet. And I think we should just go in boats for the remaining surface stuff and two insects and a cow, which I guess is surface stuff in a way. Oh, yeah, I mean, all of these caves look kind of good, but we've dipped into some of them and I didn't hear like any definitive proof or see definitive proof of a dungeon existing there. So hard to say if there would have been one. That was very close. Yeah, you have to die. That's just one though, because we need two. Uh, I guess we'll take this guy. Well, now he's swimming away. Stuck in the ground here for a second. All right, three. Second one, of course. Uh, Chunker, cow, saddle, so dungeon. And then the horror deep down stuff, right? Redstone, gold, lapis, diamonds. I feel like we must be missing something else, but I don't know what that would be. <laughs> Just looking at our score, 12, it feels like I have to be more items left somehow. But I don't know. I guess the fish, the milk bucket, that's 14, 15, 16 are the chunk items, and then diamond, 17, 18, gold, 19, lapis, and then, I don't know, cauldron, Rails, compass, minecart with chest. And there's something else missing. The rest of the repeater probably. I don't think I mentioned that. Is that 25? It might be. There's a there's a temper that should give us a diamond. <laughs> and a saddle. I don't know if they have saddles. I never know. I think they do. But <laughs> I'm not sure. Also, I've not been really looking at the ocean floor very much. I've been more concerned with the, the stronger part of the equation. Just don't don't blow this up now. I hate the rabbits. Always sound very scary, but they're good. Uh, well, this is saddle. I guess I'll correct some emeralds for whatever reason. I would have really liked a diamond there, of course. But there is one, right? We don't need bones, or enchanted book, or gunpowder. There was no gourd. That's kind of unlucky, actually. Usually there's some gourd. And in this case, two would have been enough. Which is not a very tall order, so could have had that. I don't know where it came from now. I haven't seen the mesa yet. Uh, I would really like to not get shot by a skeleton anymore. That's a chunker. So the chunker and the cow. Uh, maybe we can grab two gourd on our way by the mesa towards the chunker. That would be nice. Because just you know, it's just crossed off the list. And that looks, it looks like this cave right there. And actually there are cows right here. We'll take those for sure, because you never know how rare these guys are. <coughs> Any given run. <coughs> how, how do I miss these crits? Why is your baby zombie here? <coughs> this is bad. Let's just go away. I wish I could pick up some more food because we're low. But it's just not worth it. Ah, oh, man. Okay, there are more cows on this side. They're, I guess they're not that many, though. But they are easier to get to. Come on. Stupid boat. So annoying. I mean, this feels kind of slow. But we need food, I'm pretty sure. We do have the carrots, the carrots are such bad food. Mm. Alright, let's just go to the chunker and hope that we get all the things. 
Stop shooting me. We forgot about the Mesa Cave right there. But okay, that's, that's okay. It's just two gold. We're fine. Two gold. So we need to fish too. That was dumb. I should have fished uh, at those cows and started cooking them. Second herd of cows. There we go. Not a lot hard to find, and lots of them here. Very good. Uh, that cave looks like maybe the spot we go down. Why another skeleton there? Come on, game. <laughs> Just make it a zombie or something. Something I can ignore. Uh, heard that guy. Uh, I mean, whatever. I can't. I can't split this. I should split this door. I mean, this is not. It's not Arvin or Cook, obviously. Save your comments. <laughs> I know. Fish, redstone. We're doing okay, we're doing okay. Gonna craft our iron stuff. Make another bucket, for sure. Could we just get a fish here? Excellent, All right. Uh, and then I wanna craft, I think. Still sloppy, man. What's wrong with my fingers? Uh, oh, you want iron short? How? How did I miscount? I, I don't know. I miscounted though. It's fine. Because we still need a compass now. I thought we had extra gold, but we didn't. Uh, iron, I mean, not gourd. Alright, two blue. I need some more wood, maybe. And there's that cave entrance right somewhere over here. Not this. I don't remember where it was now. I think it's more on this side, like here. That I kind of like. Sure, yeah, that element is still around. That makes sense. But he wouldn't have died. Uh, I don't know. That's just bad inventory. I hate it. A little bit better. <laughs> Not much. Well, I mean, 44. It didn't get us all the way down there, but that's fine. Uh, four redstone, two gold, and then two blue things. Uh, I'm kind of scared of dropping into that baby zombie. Uh, A little bit scary, admittedly, but okay. I don't like the spot we're in at all. Ruined gold. And I guess, yeah, we need to smelt, but we'll wait, I think, until we have the gold. No. I have to be something blocked by block. Down there, 
looks pretty good. Emerald right here, of course. Nope, does not look good at all. I was wrong. There's no way to go from here, right? No. So you have to go this way. And then... You have to put spider skeleton, I think. As a dungeon, it's not very good for us. It's not a very good cave. Oh man, I could... Yeah, I wish I could have found the gold before we have to do this, but... I don't know that we can wait much longer, so... And then this. And then, oh yeah, new axe, of course. And then this. Two gold and one diamond. Not a very long list. Ah, that skeleton dungeon right there is so bad for us. Can you maybe? No, can't kill that zombie because you have to wait exactly until the moment the zombie is not in the line of sight anymore. Then you shoot. I don't know if I can rush by this dungeon because I don't know if I'll be stuck on the other side. It's bad development. Also, I'm pretty sure there's a zombie there. there somewhere. Okay, these guys are fighting. Of course, he waits just until I'm in front to shoot. Maybe just die, guy. Uh, oh, he just keeps that ending on me. Come on. Well, got that at least. Uh, man, yeah. I guess we dig. The cave is just not very good looking up there. Right, it's all up there, that's the problem about it. Also I feel like we got really unlucky. We had two villages and uh, the desert temper and did not get a diamond. I don't think we should be digging though. But the cave up there is just like a mess. <laughs> I don't want to deal with, I don't know. It's hard to make these cars sometimes. There was more cave down to the left, or well, I don't know if it was down, but past the dungeon to the left instead of to the right. To the right definitely went down, that's why I went right, not left. But I don't hear anything. I was hoping to just find more cave. It feels like whatever we do, it's like bad, so I don't know. <laughs> Just not a very lucky finish here. I think I'm gonna go back up after all. Yeah, sure. Why not? I uh, need some sticks now. There we go. And then put my axe back there, please. Actually, yeah. I don't know how did how did that axe already take that many hits? I just made it and it ran. Hit like two different skeletons for a total of like four times. Which is like half the durability is gone. It's another dungeon right there. This is the place I was talking about. That maybe goes down. It does. It should be fairly easy to see. If there are diamonds here, 
but it's not because it's too narrow to get a good look. Yeah, but I don't think it goes down again. Lots of stuff here, but nothing great. And this way we have a diamond. How did I not see that? I should have seen that for sure. I'm blind, apparently. Well, that was slower than it needed to be. Left versus right. Definitely went the wrong way there, and then I don't know how I didn't see it. I mean, it was only a couple of seconds, but but still, I, how did I? How did I not see it here? Where was it? It was this block, right? Yeah, I guess it's just not not yeah. It's just behind that coal block there, running in here. Maybe it was like. For a split second when I was but I think like I rotated pretty early. I'm not sure, maybe it was on screen. So yeah, we went to the right first and that was the wrong way and then went to a second <laughs> second crossroads here and went right again. That was also wrong. We should have gone left twice and then we would have had a blackout. I don't know. About a minute ago. Oh, actually, no, we wouldn't have had the. We got the gold on the right side there. And there's no super easy gold on this side. Yeah, it was just like an unfortunate cave. Not a bad cave, but it had everything. It was not super slow. It was just. It was just not really great layout wise. And those open dungeons kind of made it a little bit trickier to move to. I actually just want to open it on this side, apparently. So that was just a random skeleton group spawn, or did they all come from up there? Why? I was... I don't know, I thought I was in the right spot. Oh no, yeah, that's the skeleton spawn. Okay, that's where they came from. Oh, and that would have pushed us up here to the ravine. Interesting. There's a weird cave layout. It's another weird, narrow, short ravine. Yeah, this is a very weird looking cave. Lots of dungeons over there. Haha, <laughs> actually I wanna be looking at this. Kind of meh. On this one. Don't think there was a saddle, but I didn't really look. <laughs> to be perfectly honest. Uh, where are we now? What's this part of the cave? Have I been here? Oh yeah. No, well, maybe not. An enchanted book. That would have been a saddle. A name tag and the enchanted book. That's a very good, very good chest. Or very good dungeon. Some wheat, some gunpowder, some redstone. That's pretty perfect. No seeds, but other than that, that's pretty good. And I, is that another dungeon? Yeah, right here. Is that the zombie dungeon? Yeah. Had some seeds. So, I don't know, pretty good time, pretty good run. Maybe should have been a little bit faster. Um, I don't know. We forgot about the gold over there. Which was where? Here. But we have had very easy access to gold in this little through cave. No, okay, so it was not super worth it to stop here. Yeah, no, it probably was just not worth it at all. Which is okay. It still could have, could have been a good decision, because yeah, we ended up having to look for the gold downstairs, so if we could have grabbed it here, that would have been nice, so checking would not have been a bad move, but... This was a really bad spot. <laughs> Made too many mobs here. Um... And then yeah, chunker. I didn't even see that second chunker. 
I think we're yeah we're basically definitely going to find our melons. Yeah, more melons here. So for sub twenty five, we would have needed the diamond someplace, and then a little bit more urgency in the end. Probably, I I don't feel like I played very well at the end. I don't know that I, I didn't handle the cave very well. Um, I don't know. It's just sometimes it feels like you can like the the cave layout was just very hard to get a feel for usually like some some caves you just see over and over again obviously ravines are very you know easy like you have that layout you see a ravine you know what that cave look like looks like but then some other caves you also get sort of a feel for them like this part of the cave looks like exactly the way i would have expected it to look but then this down here was all kind of strange looking because there's like this arm here that goes into this dead end and then there's uh this arm here that loops up and around and then this goes up and around i don't know it's a very it's hard to like if you're standing in here you have no idea which way like it's very claustrophobic down here even like there's no there's no open space you can't see where where the, the open cave is is it on this side is it on that side it was kind of hard to manage uh that and then I guess I could have had some gold right here and more emeralds of course because we didn't need them. Diamonds right here, that was pretty close. Because we were here. It's not very far away at all. It's not super likely that we go this way, but it could have happened. But there also wasn't very much lapis. Usually these caves have tons of lapis veins. I, I only remember the one. This one. I guess there's one here that I couldn't see because this is closed off. Another weird chunk of cave disconnected. Oh, I, I guess I must have seen this one too. I just didn't. I didn't commit to memory. All right. Yeah, it's a pretty good run. It's a very, very forgiving kind of spawn point for sure. I don't even think I played with enough urgency day one. But you got you got a lot of stuff done. Had a solid bait. Other than food, I think we did pretty pretty well there. And this only had an enchanted book, right? Oh yeah, and the saddle. We did, we did get the saddle here. It was not it was not a bust. It was worth it to go down here. It definitely was. How do I not remember which which way I came from? I didn't come from the maze, so I didn't come from the from the eye, so it has to be this way or that way, right? Looks like this way is right, but I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah, this is right. This is the lonely swamp tree. Because, yeah, the spawn point, obviously, two villages is good, and then this very big swamp uh, gives you a really good opportunity to get um, to get a slime bar day one. And also had the mushrooms, you know, clay and sand, the cactus green, the acacia sapling, the sugar cane. It's just a pretty good spawn point overall. I also definitely based have a little bit of a hut out there. I could have saved us some, some smelting time. <laughs> but I think it's too far away to be really used for. Um, but yeah, an interesting interesting one. Interesting run. I'll take it. Sub 30 is, is good. It just is. Um, I don't think... I mean... If there's no slime bar on this card, it could be it could be a candidate for a very very fast fast run because then you can leave much sooner. Like one of the reasons I messed with you know looking for villages and stuff, it it just felt like I had time, and I kind of did because we did still get to the swamp you know easily on time for night four, and it felt like we had to stick around there anyway, so might as well just try to get like one or two extra items out of it. Um, that's also why I dug up all that iron day one. It's just you, you, that swamp was like as good as it was going to get, and if you ask me, so no reason to leave. And then, obviously, if there's no slime bar, if there's in the pearl of no hard mob drop, I would have left much much sooner. I would have uh, rushed much much more through that first stage. I would not have mined all that iron. I would have probably done like eight or ten or something and then left. Um. 
And I think I would have still left the way we left because that looked like the most open ocean. Um, then we would have, would have probably always, always found that Desert Temper and then from there, very likely that Changer just passed that. And then after that, it depends, I guess, what uh, what replaces the slime or that would have changed the complexion of the car completely. But that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you very soon with more Minecraft Bingo. Bye-bye.